So title is, is there evidence that walking groups have health benefits, a systematic review and meta-analysis by Hansen and Jones? Uh, and so this was a meta-analysis on, um, on intervention studies with adult walking groups outdoors. So I didn't know that this was such a robust uh, area of research, largely because like, I don't know, I, I tend to focus on exercise physiology and, and strength stuff and not necessarily like public health interventions. But I think this is pretty popular in research like in the UK where, uh, you know, they just <laughs> get a bunch of adults and they're like, hey, why don't you guys get together and walk through the park for a little bit and we'll see if that does anything good. Uh, so there were 42 studies that met the inclusion criteria for this meta-analysis. Uh, and, and like I said, they were all adult subjects and it was outdoor walking groups. So you, you get together with, you know, maybe half a dozen, a dozen people and you just stroll through the park for, you know, 30 minutes, an hour and not a particularly intense pace. And uh, all of the studies uh, included in this meta-analysis lasted for a year or less. So they're relatively short-term studies. Uh, everything I'm about to talk about, you don't necessarily need to do it for five years to start seeing improvements. Uh, so all of the interventions lasted a year or less, uh, and they led to significant decreases in systolic blood pressure, diastolic blood pressure, resting heart rate, body fat percentage, body mass index, total cholesterol, uh, depression scores on a, on a standard like depression symptoms inventory, uh, increased VO2 max, increased six minute walk distance, and score on the SF36 physical functioning inventory, which is basically just asking like kind of how much you struggle with activities of daily living, stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so uh, <laughs> essentially they found that if you get outside with your homies uh, and walk a little bit, not even that much, uh, a few times a week, 30 minutes for an hour, uh, within a year that can reduce 10 different risk factors for all cause mortality, which is uh, pretty striking, I think. Um, and like you mentioned, it, I, you can't necessarily attribute the findings of this meta-analysis solely to walking. Like there could be a social component since it was all group-based, might be influenced just by getting folks outside a bit more. Um, but the, the bulk of the intervention itself was a walking intervention. Um, so yeah, all of which is to say, uh, I do think that the population level associations we see between walking and all cause mortality, I do think it's far more than mere association. There's a lot of evidence that walking interventions modify known risk factors of mortality, specifically, uh, cardiovascular disease mor mortality. Um, and yeah, like it's, it's not just, uh, I don't think it's a mere association.